You know what time it is. It's Monday, make Monday. 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 It's Make Money Mondays with Sean V. Everybody, this is Sean V. Bradley, president of Dealer Synergy, and you know what time it is. It is Make Money Mondays. What time is it? I said it's Make Money Mondays. It's time to make that money. And today, we're going to talk about something a little different. We're going to talk about respecting your prospects. Sean, I respect people. I'm sure you do. So this is not for you. So you should still watch it because it'll be good for you anyway. But this is for all the people that could benefit from this message for today. And you know who you are. First and foremost, our industry is amazing. There's so much opportunity, but we all know it's filled with a bunch of chaos and craziness sometimes. It's controlled chaos. And one of the things is our mouths. Salespeople like to talk, 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 talk. And we talk about the craziest things. What you say is so important, even if people aren't there to hear you, okay? And especially if people are there to hear you. So when we talk about people that have got bad credit, no credit, as bogues, roaches, mooch, rats, all these crazy things, that has got to stop. It's inappropriate. When we talk about selling Indians or Chinese people as Patels or Chinos or this or that, it is bad. If we turn around and we're bragging that we just made a 10 pound, 15 pound deal that we just cracked the shit out of somebody on that car or put them into that sled, I mean like, yo, you might be laughing right now, stop it, I'm dead serious. Words become things. If you could make money for yourself, for your family, for your children off of somebody else, pay these people the respect that they deserve. If you could make a hundred, two hundred, three hundred thousand dollars in this industry making money, more money than doctors, lawyers, physicists, scientists, all sorts of stuff, just from selling cars, then you owe these people that respect and appreciation and just consideration, even if they can't hear you uh, talking behind their back. I'm just saying. Now, on the flip side of things, you need to respect their situation. Sometimes people can't afford a certain car. To shove them into a car they can't afford and put them in a worse situation is counterproductive. Dr. Covey says, you know, in The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People, that the win-win, there's always a win-win. Find the win-win. A win for the dealership and a win for the prospect and a win for you as the consultant with your pay plan. Win-win-win. Don't try to keep cracking people where it's upside down and only in your favor because you might get some stupid people once or twice, but they're not going to keep sending people to you. You're like, yes, they do. That's still bad business. If you focus on respecting their situation, seek first to understand. Understand what they can afford. Understand what their wants, wishes, and needs are. Be a consultant. Respect them. Help them get into an automobile. Remember, folks, this is the second largest item they will ever buy in their lifetime next to a home for the average American. Think of the stress, the difficulty, this, that, and the other thing. How would you feel if this was your mother, father, brother, sister, daughter, or son that was buying a car and someone, like I just mentioned, was selling them an automobile? Exactly. So at the end of the day, respect your prospects. That's all I'm saying. Thank you so much for watching this week's episode of Make Money Mondays. If you like the information you found here, then you will absolutely love Bradley On Demand. Bradley On Demand is the most comprehensive, in-depth virtual training platform in the automotive industry. We teach you everything from internet sales to phone sales, F&I and everything in between. So sign up at www.bradleyondemand.com.